All right, our next spark is by Leif Olson, and the title is Tesla History. Leif, read his, since reading his first book at age three, he has craved knowledge from picture books to fusion reactors, and now he's going to share it. Give it up for Leif. All right, hi everybody, my name is Leif, and tonight I'm gonna to be talking about Nikola Tesla. Okay, so this guy is a pure genius. He invented so many things that we invented or that we use today in modern technology. Let's see here. Okay. Um, he has pioneered radio waves. He invented the X he pioneered the X-ray. He invented radar. He invented the modern electric motor, and that's just a few. Unfortunately, many invention ideas were stolen or not cared about by the public. Uh, he didn't get much credit for anything, really, besides alternating current electricity, which is the electricity that we use to power the world, uh, except for in battery-powered devices. Um, <laughs> okay, so everybody thinks of Edison, Thomas Edison, as... A hero, he invented the light bulb, he invented the battery. No, he's not a hero, nobody think that, okay? No, he stole everything from Tesla, seriously. If direct current, he invented direct current of electricity. If it ran the world, we would not be happy people, okay? Thick wires, power plants every square mile. It's not very good. That's why we have alternating current electricity, developed by Nikola Tesla. We have, um, it requires less power plants, thinner wires. It loses, a l it loses less electricity in the process. Okay. Um, so Edison, he did not like how Nikola Tesla quit. Okay, so Nikola Tesla worked for him, and Ni Nikola Tesla quit. He invented alternating current electricity. Edison electrocuted pets to prove that it was not safe when it actually was. All Nikola Tesla ever wanted to do was make the world better. People took advantage of him for that and stole his ideas. Nikola Tesla didn't care because he wanted people to, well, be happy. <laughs> um, uh, okay, so he um, invented a death ray, an earthquake machine, this big, this big. A Tesla coil shoots lightning practically. It's amazing. So Nikola Tesla, he lived in Colorado. Yeah, and um, he uh, worked with radio waves here, and he thinks he got a message from Mars. Yeah, that was one of his main flukes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so while he was working with electricity, uh, this was when he lived in New York. He, um, he uh, wanted to trans find a way to transmit stuff really easily. This, uh, the Warden Cliff Tower uh, was saved by, it was his idea to transmit communication throughout the world. But uh, the oatmeal.com, they actually saved it from being demolished. Really awesome. Yeah, let's hear it for them. Um, and back to the Tesla. Um, money, Tesla didn't have that much money. Sometimes he didn't even have enough money to buy food. All he needed was enough money to buy materials and people, they didn't even care. They let him die alone. Uh, uh, so he really, he was a hermit. Thanks to the pig. Um, thanks, Mom. Uh, so, yeah, uh, he did so many things for humanity, and nobody recognizes him except for these guys. Uh, Nikola Tesla was actually one of the first people to have an energy-saving car. I don't know if that's true, but I heard that off the Internet. Uh, so... Um, <laughs> So yeah, they named the car after him, all that. Uh, if he were born in the 1600s, yeah, he would most likely have been tried for witchcraft. I mean, a cylinder this big that can wreck a neighborhood? Give me a break, seriously. Is that even? Yeah. Um, so yeah, he was very close friends with Mark Tain. He never married. He lived in Colorado Springs. He was born in modern Croatia, and he had a huge respect for both Christianity and Buddhism. Yeah, uh, bottom quote there, pretty funny. Um, so yeah, he's brightened the future for all of us. He's made it great for us. Why am I even using the speech? Um, he's, he's been awesome. He's done so much for us. Because of him, we have so many great things. A few more slides. Uh, 
So he went virtually unappreciated. He starved. He lived for at the age of 80 off crackers, and then he died. It, it's sad. It really is sad. So we should appreciate people. Thanks to Nikola Tesla, we have many things that we have today. And we, we just got to appreciate people like him who works hard for us. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you.